Giants fans, G1 and G3 is back. The wait's over. I'm sorry for our uh, absence out of your life, but uh, Cogs are back and it's an exciting time for us. We're back and it's a tribute to the Farmers match this weekend against Geelong at Skoda Stadium Field. But today, Cogs, you and I, let's channel our inner farmer and go on and get talking all things farmer, mate. In C boys, we really wear these hats, do we? Yeah, I think that's... They just look stupid, don't they? <laughs> Would you feel more at home if you wore this hat? Um, yeah, I was just saying out there, I need hats. So. Oh, you can borrow this, mate, if you want. That's fair. You okay. know, we both win in this situation because one, Jerry gets to cover up his hair and two, we get to unveil your hair, Cox. It's yep. winner, winner, chicken dinner. We've got a couple of questions to, um, to ask you. Just, just, a, just a test. Okay, on average, how many eggs will a hen lay in a year, Jeremy? Just a year. mate. Approximate. I don't know, probably, I'd say one a day, 350. Obviously, you love your eggs and obviously you got close down to ounce so it was 300. This week we played Geelong, your old side. And on top of that, it's Farmers Week, so it's all really just come together perfectly for this weekend. It has, mate, it has, you know. Geelong is a, uh, a big region for farming, and it's just, yeah, I'm really proud to be part of, um, you know, such an important, important region, important round for the AFL. How many eggs will a hen lay in a year? 100. <laughs> 100? <laughs> a hen doesn't lay eggs, no. Christian Jackson on the show. Uh, what, a, what number of appearance is this? I think it's number three. It's been a while, so it's good to get back on. Would you say that you're the polar opposite of a country boy? Uh, yeah, absolutely. Will the word city slicker, silver spoon, and that kind of thing be thrown at you on a regular basis at this football club? All the time. How many eggs will a hen lay in a year? Oh, um, 300 ish, maybe. 300, yeah. Phil? <laughs> Uh, the answer is actually 300. Phil, why don't we go ahead and have a look at this week's Simply Clever Moments. Skoda Simply Clever Moments. Let's get into it. Skoda. Simply Clever. Cleverly hooked out by Cornelio. Now this is a tough one for Green. Handball forward Hampton. He got away from Robinson. Then goes for the outside of the boot. Jamison didn't touch it. Great goal, Hampton. Yeah, we just see currently Hampton just getting involved here. And I love this because he's taking the game on. He saw a little bit of a gap. And it went on the right side with the check side, so... Skoda. Simply clever. Gee whiz, Phil, that was good by Kelly, wasn't it? Hats off to him, Cogs. What is the longest recorded flight... In seconds. ...flight uh, of a chicken? In seconds. Seconds-wise. That's a massive hint, mate, because I thought it was like five minutes. In seconds. Um, I'm going to say 17 seconds. 13 metres. Oh. So, oh, no, no, in time. We want it oh, in time. Uh, time. Okay. Um, they probably travel a metre a second, though. All right, we'll go seven seconds. Five seconds. Gee, they probably go about a metre a second, and you've done 13 metres. Uh, oh. we'll just half it, close no, enough. No, no, we'll no, just... No, no. <laughs> we'll just Have a think of it, dude. They've a metre a second, Yeah. and you just said they travel 13 metres. <laughs> well... Um, it's 13 metres even in the ballpark. No, yeah, no, listen, uh, just, listen. <laughs> 13 metres could be right, and let's say they travel. 13 seconds. Oh, he's done it. He's oh, done it. Go. He's done it. This is a bit of a tongue twister, this one. So, yep. don't get concerned about the fact that I mumble at times and my enunciation isn't quite correct. Apologies to my grandma. Don't actually speak proper English in there. Um, anyway, true or false? Ladybugs are good bugs because they gobble up the bad bugs. True or false? Yeah. Ah, false. Um, false. False. Pardon? False. Pardon? True. True. <laughs> True enough. Hey! How often do farmers milk their cows a day? Uh, twice a day. Twice a day? Uh, twice a week. We'll just get in some expert help here. Toby Green, Come on, what's the Toby. answer to question five? How often do farmers milk their dairy cows a day? Two. There it is, that's the answer right there, twice. Twice a day. Got there in the end. Before we finish Cogs, the Kevin Sheed Challenge, get onto the uh, website, have a look at the details here. Get typing, we're about to go and do it. Um, so get stuck and see if you can beat the whiz. He's only been doing it for 65 years, the big fella. So have a go, see if you can beat him. We want to shout out to all our fans that have been tweeting in, have been Facebooking in. Get on the club website, follow us at, at, at Twitter or you know, tweet you, Phil. Tweet me, yep. Instagram something. 
oh, yeah. Facebook saying to the club. I'm on Instagram now. I'm yeah, just, I'm just showing him a bit on Instagram yeah, as well. So jump on board, uh, give us some insights, and Cogs and I will do our best to uh, to get going forward. And you know, look, good luck for this weekend's match, Cogs against Geelong. Obviously, I'm a sneaky. Yeah, we'll uh, <laughs> we'll have to leave you out this week, I reckon, Phil. Ah, oh, yep. No, you can't but, win them all, mate. But uh, in all seriousness, though, it's a big game, so everyone get down to it. It's going to stadium. It's not if you get to see a great team like Geelong. Probably one of the greatest teams in modern uh, in modern football. We know three premierships in five years, and they're going for another one this year. So we'll, we're ready for put up a good contest, Cogs, and uh, let's celebrate the farmers as well. Good episode, huh? Cheers, mate.